The National Gallery is an art museum in Trafalgar Square in the city of Westminster in central London. Founded in 1824, it houses a collection of over 2,300 paintings dating from the mid-13th century to the 1900s. The National Gallery was designed by William Wilkins from 1832 to 1838. Only the façade to Trafalgar Square remains essentially unchanged. The current director of the National Gallery is Gabriel Finaldi. It's among the most visited art museums in the world. The leading artists of this period achieved a fame that has never dismissed. Especially in Italy, Renaissance painters sought to rival and surpass the artists of ancient Greece and Rome. Portraitists were highly prized, and pictures of ancient history and mythology became almost as important as Christian subjects. We can quote some names, for example like Leonardo da Vinci, Cronache, Michelangelo, Raphael, or Aubain. This painting is The Raising of Lazarus by Sebastiano del Piombo. The subject of this painting is taken from the New Testament, John 11. At the request of the sisters Martha and Mary, Jesus visits the grave of the brother Lazarus. The 17th century is represented by famous painters as Rembrandt, Velázquez, Rubens, and Van Dyck. They took their inspiration in art of the past, but they have their own style from the blazing to the austere. Religious subjects were treated in novel to engage the emotion of the viewers. In Netherlands, there is a specialist painter of still life, landscape, but also scene of common life. This painting is called The Toilet of Venice and it was painted by Diego Velázquez in the 17th century. Venice was the goddess of love and she was considered as a female beauty. She is represented with Cupid who have a mirror for her. Nude woman was not appreciated in painting by church so this painting is one of the last which survive. 